This half hour brought to you by Sperm, the Society for the Preservation, Evacuation, and Rescue of Men. <laughs> Many women are noticing a shortage of men in the world today. Fewer of them on the bus and in the health club, book clubs trying to enlist men, and fewer men in church. And there are many reasons for that. This would be one of them right here. Well, I'll just go up on the roof and check. No, honey, honey, please. Run this extension ladder up here. Uh, no, no, just call a repairman, please. No problem. I'll have it fixed in a jiffy. With, honey, with, with, oh. 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 It's an old story, been repeated over and over and over and over. Hey, Bob, I need a sawhorse to cut this board on you. Would you kneel down there and let me oh, put sure. it on your back? All right, okay. Okay, okay, hold steady there. Yes, men who have the genetic urge to solve problems, but they lack the skill. <sighs> Gosh, I wonder why this pilot light went out here. Hey, Jim. Yeah? Got a cigarette here? Oh, yeah. Here, y you need a light? Thanks. <laughs> Men's skills have changed over the years as the job market has changed. And Men who are highly skilled in high-tech jobs, such as computer engineering, for example, may think they know about electricity, but they don't. Oh, honey, please don't. Not, not with a screwdriver. Oh, it's only a fuse box, but, for heaven's sake. Yeah, but, but no, 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 no. Men who are learned at the law do not necessarily know about machinery. Honey, here's the clippers. Oh, I don't need any clippers. Well, how are you going to trim the hedge then? Yeah, watch this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to pick up the lawnmower, no, not the fast way. No, 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 no. The male drive to solve problems is a powerful drive, and men are susceptible to getting into trouble. I really wish you wouldn't try to paint the ceiling here in the stairwell, honey. Just, just, just call a painter. Oh, no need for that. Oh. See, I got the scaffolding set know, up and the stepladder on there. And on the scaffolding, when you lean the ladder against the walls, yeah. the back legs of the ladder rest right on the little edge yeah. right there. I'm fine. Let me show you. Okay, okay, okay. okay but, but, but be careful. Let's stop that scene right there. But just hold that scene there. You know the man is about to fall, break his neck. And all she can say is, be careful? Oh, please. A woman has a couple of options at this point. She can say, Honey, this is a loaded pistol in my hand. And if you put one foot on that ladder, it'll be the last step you ever take. <laughs> or if you don't want to involve firearms, you can try this. Honey, I need to tell you something. I'm having an affair with Bob the Handyman. We're in love. These are the divorce papers in my hand. And I got you a room at the Super 6 Motel out on the freeway. Hi there, I'm Bob. Uh, let me step in there and take care of this for you. Bye. The Society for the Preservation, Evacuation, and Rescue of Men. Sweetheart, there are men who know how to do this. I'm calling one right now. Right now.